everyone and welcome back to another video. I hope everyone's doing well today. So today's video is going to be a little crafting video because I was gifted an item that sells on Amazon uh, for me to review. So that's what we're going to do today. Now I did receive it on November 18, so this is well overdue. But with everything that went on last week, uh, I hope that they understand why I, uh, I was delayed on getting this video out. So what I did receive was a full size hot glue gun. So it came in this box. I haven't um, tried it out or anything yet. Uh, I will link the item down in um, my description. So it will be in Canadian prices. So it, it was $39.99 is what it sells for. Uh, and uh, it's very lightweight, like the box is really light too. It's 426 grams. So when I opened it up to have a look at it, I was pleasantly surprised. So you do get the little booklet with it. And uh, that's the glue gun right there. It's, it's nice and it flat on the bottom, so it will stand up. So I really like that. Um, then I got the red light on the back. On the front there, it's got two switches. So it is uh, a dual power. Uh, it'll be like a low heat and a high heat. See if you can see that right there. Uh, the cord is uh, removable, which is also nice for storing it. So there's the cord. And uh, they gave me some glue sticks. Pack of glue sticks there. There it is. Ooh, four, six, eight, ten, so twelve glue sticks in it, and I also got little uh, finger protectors. There's three in there as well, like three different sizes. So what I thought I would do with this uh, gun to try it out was to um, redo one of my wreaths. So this one's going to go on my door out to my um, sunroom. So it had some, I've had this wreath for many, many years and it had some um, picks on it, but I took the picks off already. And I had picked up these uh, pine cones at Dollarama that I haven't hauled yet. And they were 375, but I come to realize that they're too big to go on my wreath. I think they are anyway. So we're not gonna use those. We are going to use ones that came from outside. So I've got six of them here. So we're gonna put those on. Uh, I had this off a project that I had before. So somehow we're gonna glue this one on. And I also picked up these bells. Let me put this down. These bells were 350 from Dollarama. Again, I haven't hauled these yet either. I need to try to keep them quiet or I'll have Miss Onyx in wanting to play with them. So yeah, they were $3.75. So we're gonna put this on the wreath as well. So I did decide to just leave my um, my red bow on it because it was, uh, it's pretty, it's there, and it matches the two red bows that I have on my two planters outside that I also haven't decorated yet. So I do need to uh, get in the Christmas spirit a bit because December 1st is approaching us very fast. All right, so I'm going to come back. I'm gonna set up the camera over my wreath and we are going to test out this hot glue gun together. I'll be right back. Okay, I am back. So I've uh, taken out my little silicone. Let me just move some stuff around here. I've taken out my little silicone uh, glue gun mat that I did pick up at... Uh, Dollar Tree, so I'm not sure if it will, you know, drip or anything, but look at how lovely that stands up on its own. So I do have the hot glue gun plugged in, and I have uh, one glue stick in already. Let me grab another one to push that along. And I do have um, some finger protectors that I did buy at uh, 
Dollar Tree as well, but we're going to try these ones out. So there's three different sizes. This one's huge. So yeah, you definitely will not burn your fingers with these. So I'm going to use these two. I'll put this one on my thumb. And we'll put this one on my finger. So I've kind of placed the um, pine cones where I'd like them. And the Merry Christmas. So once this heats up, we will uh, start to glue these on. Now I am a left-handed, so I do everything backwards. But look at that. It heated up pretty fast. Easy to squeeze because I don't have a lot of arm strength. So that's a bonus for me. We're just going to stick that right in there. I can hear Onyx crying. She probably wants some more milk. I usually give her some milk around this time. I do hope the lighting is good because the last video I made, I wasn't using my ring light, but it came on. And uh, I went to turn it on there today because it's a bit overcast. It's actually snowing. That's a good hold right there. It's actually snowing and uh, it doesn't want to turn on. So I'm going to have to get my husband to take a look at that for me. Really like this glue gun so far. I like how um, the glue is coming out. So I did put two sticks in. Look at that. So I think we'll stick this one right about here. Because remember, I'm going to have those bells hanging from it. one this is beautiful to use I've never had a full-size glue gun before so I am liking it okay did you guys see what I just did I put these on my left hand and I'm using this oh my goodness Caroline <laughs> I hope you're all laughing with me here anyway I don't need the finger protectors because I'm using large uh, pine cones that I'm definitely not going to burn my fingers on. Oh my goodness. I don't know where my head is being this past week. Oh my goodness. All right. Here's the last one. Well, I hope I gave you all a good laugh there. <laughs> I need a couple of laughs myself anyways. Yeah. Just waiting for the vet to call so that I can go and pick up my babies. I'll be happy when I have them home. What? What's the matter? Onyx. Where are you? All right. So we'll kind of maybe um, use the branches to hold this up. So let's just get a little bit of glue on this. This one I might burn my fingers on but we'll just glue across it there some here this you know the tip on this is so nice that you can put a lot of glue or just a little so we're going to be generous with this so it doesn't blow off I hear ya did you need some more milk she's getting spoiled with the milk that um I can't get her to drink water even when I watered it down so we're going to have to work on that, aren't we, Miss? I, I was going to say marble. Oh, my goodness. Miss Onyx. All right, let's see if we can get this onto some branches here so it won't. Yep. There. That should hold. She's trying to climb up my legs here. That should hold right in there. Perfect. So let me just grab some scissors here. I'm just going to cut off the tag that was on those uh, bells. Did you hear my bells? Is that what you hear? Something to play with? All right, so we're going to use these and we're going to... I wonder if I should take this bow off because you're not going to see it. And then I can always use it for another project. <clears throat> what are you trying to tell me? Eh? 
Oh, this is glued on pretty good. Um, let's see, because I need that. Maybe it's not going to come off so easy. All right, we will leave it because we don't want the bells to fall off. <clears throat> so I'm going to just um, try and tuck it in here underneath and then maybe a uh, little bit of hot glue. Oh, here she comes. Here she comes. She fell. Let me just grab a drink of water here. <clears throat> what? Do you want to make an appearance? I guess, um, hmm. I do want that bow to come off, so let's cut that off. Okay, let's cut this off. We can uh, use that ribbon for something else. All right, so our bells are going to hang here. So let's uh, put some glue on the back of the ring so that will not blow off. I'm hoping that the wind won't blow these bells or they'll be banging on my door constantly. But we will see. If it does, I will just um, take it off then. So I also picked up some little berries too. Little holly berries. They were a um, dollar fifty at Dollarama, but I don't know if I should add the green or not. There is um, there is six in it, I believe, but let's have a look. Do we want to add these in, or do we want to just... So I could add these in, too, to each uh, pine cone there. Gives it a bit of color, doesn't it? Alright, so let's do that, too, then. I think I have uh, six. Alright, so I hear ya, baby, I hear ya. All right, so what we will do is maybe just put some glue here along the uh, pick itself and hope that it will adhere to, um, oh, I'm loving this new glue gun. Appreciate them sending it to me. This doesn't want to stand up there the way I have the, uh... all right, are we going to stick these onto a branch? Okay, now I'm gluing myself to them. I think we should glue it onto a branch and then we'll have that branch uh, lean against the, um, kind of bend it in like that. So there we go, getting glue all over me here. All right, I've got another one right here. Just get my branch ready. Maybe little branch here. So pretty to see the snow outside. All right, we will glue that to this branch. So yeah, you can take an old uh, wreath that you've had and take whatever was on it and uh, change it up. Give it some new life. So, yeah, that's going to be cute with the berries. So I will be leaving a review on Amazon to my thoughts of this. And uh, you'll be able to read them. And if you want to purchase it, you can purchase it right from the link that I put out. Oh my goodness, if you cry, you're going to have everybody else crying. I kind of don't like how I did that one. Let's bend it back a bit. Yeah, I can just, you know, bend it and work with it. Did you want to come up and say hi? Where are you? Where are you? There. There. Can we say hi to the people? Say hi. My name is Onyx. 
<laughs> she's like, nope, I want to play with your wreath that you're making. Did I put this one on already? I did. All right, so these are going to be pretty hanging. They're all at three different lengths. I won't really hear it anyway because uh, there's a big door into the house from the sunroom. So it can jingle away if it wants to, as long as it doesn't disturb the animals. All right, so these guys are going to be hanging here. So we can take another branch maybe here. Yeah. So I did buy these in two sizes, but I used the bigger ones um, on my Christmas tree that's in the living room. And uh, I thought that these smaller ones would be better for the wreath anyways. So we're just going to stick these right here. Look at that. She just came jumped up on my lap. Okay, that's hot. You don't want to go near the hot glue. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, already. So that's stuck on there. I guess I should have twisted them on as well, but that's okay. That is okay. We just want it to uh, give this new glue gun a try. And I'm very pleased with it. I'll glue that one right there. And if I ever want to switch this up again, it's easy to uh, remove something that's been hot glued on. Just glue that. So yeah, I will, um, this is the last one we're gluing on. I will get this out onto the door and I'll let you see how she looks. Gonna put this one. This one's got a lot of branches here. Oh, put this little guy out and we'll stick it onto there. So there you have it. Very pleased with that. I already have this on it because the way I hang my wreaths is uh so I put this on the door. I don't know if you can see what I'm doing. So I put this, whew, I put this on the inside of the door and then I flip it over and so it's secure on the inside of the door but it's hanging outside. What do you think? I think it looks good. All right, I'm gonna go and put it on the door. I'll be right back. So here is my wreath uh, hanging on the door outside. Sorry if you can hear the wind. It is very windy and blustery cold here today. So I ended up actually, I had to pull these two off to move them up a bit so the bells would hang nice. So I ran in, grabbed the glue gun, unplugged it, came back, and believe it or not, it held enough uh, heat in it so that I could actually glue them back on right on the door. So I'm gonna give this Mon Vict a full-size glue gun a 10 out of 10 on Amazon. So let me know in the comments below if you go check out this uh, hot glue gun and um, I will be leaving a 10 out of 10 review on Amazon. So thanks for watching. Until my next video, take care and I'll catch you all in the next one. Bye for now.